We've all seen or participated in the school experiment where students have to carefully look after an egg and coddle it with the utmost care as an exercise in responsibility. This is not that experiment. 100 of the brightest grades 6, 7 and 8 students from in and around Saskatoon gathered at the University of Saskatchewan for the All Science Challenge, testing both their knowledge and applied abilities. It's been really great to be surrounded by peers who appreciate science the same way and um, this is a really good learning environment for uh, the project and you know it's, it's just a lot of fun being able to you know answer those questions, see what you know and then you know putting some of your knowledge to use. The practical part of the day involved using supplied materials to protect eggs as they were dropped from varying heights. With this level of intelligence in one area, it's no surprise participants looked for any advantage they could find. Really hard no, sadly they are not. In addition to ensuring a safe plummet, students had to deal with the challenges of leaving one part of the egg exposed, as well as just working together. I guess, sure, we should put that on the table. Tape those on, tape it. I don't think we need to This side's heavier, so if we put it on this side, then it actually It's a really good opportunity because you're not only working individually, but there's also teamwork. So then you kind of get both opportunities, and it's all working towards a collective goal. And the creativity wasn't just on display when it came to protecting the eggs. Many of the groups also came up with elaborate backstories for their subjects. This is our uh, baby Bob. And so, you know, he's being dropped off by the stork and, you know, the people, the storks just wanted to make sure that he was safe when he was falling, just wanted to make sure that uh, he wouldn't crack or anything. With that kind of care and attention, it's no surprise the egg drop itself was a little harrowing for these young scientists. It's cool. It's it's a ride. Ride. Yeah, it's yes. a it was really nerve-wracking. I thought he would die because the one right before us died and but I was really proud of our little egg. <laughs> it's okay. The All Science Challenge is an annual event held in cities across the country, but this was the first one in Saskatchewan. While it is a fun day for all involved, it also has a serious purpose. We want to encourage youth to think about science, to stay in science. Uh, however, it doesn't necessarily mean they have to do science as a career, but science in your life is important as a skill. It's important in building 21st century stewards, and that's what we're all about. But it sounds like when it comes to thinking long term about science, the participants are already a step ahead of the organizers. Have actually had the opportunities to work within labs at the um, National Research Council um, through another science competition. And it's just great because Saskatoon has so many different opportunities so that youth in Saskatoon can really appreciate what science has to offer for their future. I really want to be a scientist, like my dad is a scientist and my mom took molecular biology but she's now in some other fields and I kind of just want to continue family tradition and we have so many talks about like science at home and just, I don't know, I really love science. For Shaw TV, I'm Simon Hyatt.